You may not have known, but there are volcanoes in states along the Gulf of Mexico, and each of them have their own unique history. Today, I'm highlighting five volcanic areas and four states that date back millions of years, according to scientists. State number one, Texas. The Trans-Pecos Volcanic Field, so named because it lies west of the Pecos River. It was once the site of serious volcanic activity millions of years ago, until the stress on the Pacific Coast subduction zone subsided. In recent years, earthquakes have increased in this area. Pilot Knob Volcanic Complex, placed in the heart of Texas near Austin. Earthquakes have also been registering on USGS. Wikipedia reveals that the source of the magma comes from the upper mantle under the crust and was once completely underwater and part of the Gulf of Mexico. State number two, Louisiana. Door Point, actually located in the water in the Louisiana South. In recent years, there have been reports of bubbling methane and trees sinking into bayous and swamps and many voiced concerns about BP drilling around that area in the past. State number three, Mississippi. Jackson Volcano is well hidden under the Jackson, Mississippi Coliseum in their capital, Jackson. However, it is said to be long extinct and nothing to be concerned about. Mississippi is also home to an 1812 thrust fault uplift that caused the Mississippi River to run backwards. State number four, Florida. Waculos Volcano. This volcano used to emit strange smoke in the 1800s that seemed to stop after the Charleston, South Carolina earthquake of 1886 that was felt across mid-Florida. There is no concern for the volcano at this time. However, sinkholes and fires have been a curse in that state. Before I go, here is a brief recap of all the volcano news across the globe just from the past week. Earth has been very busy. Thank you for watching and God bless. See you soon.